I've always been told the umbilical cord got wrapped around the wrist, which then stopped the circulation in the hand form in itself. So what movement have you got in your hand? Um, it's literally that. OK. That's all it does. Kyle's dream is to become a hairdresser. I can remember playing with hair in school, sat in assembly, girls with long hair, putting it into a plait. Um, okay. So I've always wanted to do it. Never thought I would be able to. Designer Jude has come to help. Normal hairdressers hold the hair up yeah. in their fingers. So trying to get all of that hair in between that. It's quite a job. It is, yeah. yeah. See, it's sort of dropping already, and then bits so of hair that, fall out. So you need out. that tension with the fingers Yeah, I need quickly. to hold that there. So it's just sort of that I need on that side. Kyle is hoping this fix will change the way people see him. I get really, really self-conscious, in particular when I'm, when I'm eating out. There has been times I'm having to pass my plate down to my friend to cut my food up, um, which, at, yeah. which at 27 is really hard. I don't want people to look at me and judge me before they've got a chance to know me. I don't want people to give me the title as that's the guy with one hand, because I'm not a guy with one hand. I'm Kyle. Jude set to work. We have a prototype. Come, come, come. Lock. Step, 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 step. So it's really simple, and I kind of like it. But will it work? <laughs> Good to see Long you. Time, man. It's ready. Oh my god. It's incredible. It looks amazing. It looks so cool. <laughs> it does look really good. So how do you fancy giving me a little haircut then? <laughs> You're braver than me. It kind of feels like it's just my hand. I can feel the tension actually at the back of my head. It's and great. I can just really kind of see a future of me cutting hair. Whereas before I was a little bit skeptical, I guess, and I didn't 100% believe I would be able to. <laughs> and it's because of you. I literally don't know what to say.